welcome to this technical corner today i'm joined by mike harris from bison uk now today this is a little bit different mike we're going to be educating our audience in lots of different ways so firstly we've got an educational video an how-to video on how to maintain a chuck can you talk us through it please maintain a chuck if you've had a chuck for a year odd or whatever if you're using it you have to maintain these things when you're paying a lot of money for it you can't just let it go by otherwise the first thing you'll find is it will start running out the gripping will start to go the power of grip by just disassembling it taking it apart in the correct way removing the jaws in the correct way removing the back plate removing the inner scroll cleaning it re-greasing it put it back together again as is shown here you can get up to about 20 percent more gripping power so not only are you increasing the longevity of the product you're also increasing the clamping force clamping force which will, over time can be lost if you don't re-grease the correct ways and using the correct grease so great educational video here which you can see the full version on the ntd cnc platform under yes. suppliers and under bison now the next how-to video is grinding the scroll jaws can you talk us through this one please right. mike the thing with this is again you've got a new chuck if you want to buy a spare set of jaws to go with it you have you can't just put them on straight away the new jaws and find the run out is perfect because when you buy that your first chuck these jaws that are already on it have already been ground to suit so they are perfect to suit that chuck when you buy a new set you have to put them in use a clamping ring to hold them in place and then you have to just flash grind the inner side and then the front face to make sure those jaws are true what these videos shows how to do it in easy steps so it's just to ensure accuracy accuracy as well because the number of times people put a new set of jaws on and then phone us up and say oh they're running out well they're not <laughs> you have to do something to make them true so again full video yes. on how this is done yep. on the ntd cnc platform and um, so make sure to watch that video and find that video if you want to find out how to grind these jaws now next up the next how-to video is actually then installing the truck onto the machine yeah in the correct way first of all it's putting the adapter plate on the machine bolting it in tightening it to the correct way checking it as well just to make sure it's all true before you introduce the chuck as you see here look see you have to bolt it on in the correct way then afterwards in putting the chuck to put on, to fit onto it as well so everything runs in the correct way so there's a, a there's a procedure to follow Mike. procedure that's the word we're looking and, for and how Very many good. of these chucks do you you uh, sell a year well worldwide bison last year sold over twenty five thousand chucks worldwide that's self-centering and independent wow i mean they're that's big, a lot numbers. Of chucks. big numbers a lot big of numbers big numbers so once we've done all this the final stage is measuring yes. the chuck, measuring that it's true. Yeah, measuring it's true and then measuring that the jaws are correct as well and how to go about that. Make sure you put the chuck on, it's fully true. And remember what we've just spoken about, with every bison chuck, you get this booklet as well, which contains all the information you'll need from what we've just been speaking about. But to go with it, we've got these videos. And you've well. also got certification. So every chuck comes with its own certificate, to make sure it's all been made to the correct procedure as well with all the correct runouts. So it's completely identifiable. Mike, it's been an absolute pleasure as always. So if you want to watch these how-to videos in more detail or in their or in their full entirety, visit the MTDCNC platform. That's easy for you to say.